Hey, what's going on guys? Mess with the Reverts here, and today I'm gonna be talking about the map size for Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies Shadows of Evil. But before we get started, I wanted to show you guys our team photo for our men's basketball league. It's up on screen right now, and in case you guys didn't know, I'm the one on the left, and my twin brother's the one on the right. So, uh, I am pretty excited that we won. I thought I should show you guys in case you all don't know what I look like. And I also wanted to say that I'm gonna be giving out some Mountain Dew and Dorito codes for zombies, because I'm not gonna be focusing on zombies too much when the game comes out. So if you guys would like a code, leave a comment down in the comment section, and I'm going to pick out a random person, and you can say anything you want. You can comment as many times as you want, and in every video, I'm going to be doing this until Black Ops 3 comes out, so uh, I'm going to be doing this giveaway for about four weeks, so uh, I think I'm going to give out at least five codes for every video. I'm not too sure about that. It might increase. It might be a little bit less, but uh, yeah, I'm still going to be doing a giveaway for you guys as a little thank you for all the support you guys have been showing me, but yeah, now that's out of the way, let's get into the map size for Shadows of Evil. Now, a few days ago, the trophies and achievements were leaked out for Black Ops 3, and one of the trophies read, In Shadows of Evil, summon the Civil Protector in every district in a single game. So there are going to be districts that you can go to, and each district is going to have their own little buildings. Like, some districts might have a casino, uh, a hotel, etc. Like, little buildings like that. It's kind of similar to Transit from Black Ops 2, but I do believe that each district is going to be a little bit bigger than the places that the bus would take you around in Transit, because places like the town, the bus station, and and the power plant they weren't really that big so I do think these districts are gonna be a lot bigger and Morg City as a whole is gonna be very big because Treyarch has had three years to develop zombies and I'm pretty sure that the devs have added so much more depth to the map uh, than we have ever seen before in any zombies map so I'm pretty excited about Shadows of Evil but I'm not gonna be playing it straight out of the box because I really wanted to go hard in multiplayer and uh, bring you guys some tips and tricks and knowledge about the game to help you guys get better but uh, yeah guys I do think Morg City is gonna be really big and each district is gonna have more depth to it like uh, like a whole bunch of buildings not just a single building like the bus station or the power plant like we have seen before in Black Ops 2 zombies but again that's just my own little theory about the map size for Morg City again I do think that it's gonna be a fairly big map because when I think of districts I think of like little towns and stuff like that so I want you guys to let me know what you think about Morg City down in the comments if you have your own theory about the map size let me know that down in the comments as well and also please drop a like if you guys did enjoy and subscribe for the greatest call of duty Black Ops 3 news, rumors, and information. Thank y'all for watching. My name is Averts. Hope you guys have a great rest of the day. Till next time, I'll catch y'all later.